Hey guys, Trey Chris here today, we're back with The Expanse, episode 10. The last episode was just a man, things are going on. So, it looks like Naomi's returning to the main ship, but she has not realised their comms are down. Uh, along with Holden, it looks like he's about to fucking jump into the uh, core. Uh, it's definitely going to be interesting to see what's going to happen with here with Proto Molecule. It's just getting so much more interesting with each episode. I don't know how it does it. The writing of the show is phenomenal. Just amazing overall. I'm loving. I'm loving this new arc. It's so much mystery behind it. I'm actually, it's absolutely fascinating, and I'm looking forward to see just slowly how this is going to unfold. Guys, if you enjoyed the reaction, leave a like, subscribe, check out Patreon for the uncut and early access to the highlights. And let's jump into some more expand, bros. I love the core cast so much. That's an order. Best reaction. Holden's crazy. Starting to wonder if I'm cursed. Yeah, why is that? Because out of the whole human race, <laughs> you're the one flying through the mysterious alien artifact. I'm so glad they brought me back in some sort yeah. of way. That every time there's some clusterfuck shitstorm situation in the universe, there's James Holden shrugging shoulders saying, How the hell did I end up here? You're really pumping me up for this mission. <laughs> I love this. Uh, I've just finished book kid. one as well, so the whole Miller holding relationship is amazing in book one, so it's nice to get it again. It was one of my favourite things about the books, and it's so, so well done. I love how everyone's just going into the portal now, like, fuck it. <laughs> Scripture's quiet on this one. Excuse me. <laughs> Talk about I wanted to deal with someone. <laughs> Mate, she's so excited. Same to you. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Savage. No good to me. Mm. This whole minute thing is fascinating. I used to be an asshole. I love it. Oh, I missed it so much. <laughs> I didn't think I miss it as much as I just do the chilling. Uh, we've got a big back character in one way. I prefer this way. <laughs> it's better to go down swinging than rolling over. Why are you, oh, you being wait. so much like yourself? <laughs> None of this stuff weirding you out. You want me to say this is some weird shit? It's Amos. Yeah. I wish that I could tell you I was freaked out, but I'm not. Not even a little. I haven't felt fear since I was five years old. Man, I wish I could go through life without feeling. No, you don't. No. You don't. You don't. What can I say? <sighs> I want just a fool. Okay episode of his past stop thinking that being in this place that maybe this is it like we're all gonna die the say he's freaking out alex is a lot because pilot pilots are they mentioned oh. that pilots are trained to just deal Man. with everything it's obviously the most one of the crucial parts of the cruise back in baltimore lieutenant you okay no keep an eye on him just find them I guess a lot of people will be like that, to be fair. Ugh. This salty cow! The belt's first and only. And I miss Captain. Ooh. Yeah. Don't mess with Drummond. Yeah, you are. Ooh, people are listening, they're gonna spread rumours. Oh, it's actually. Oh, I thought it was like. I didn't realise it was a physical fit object. This is mental. You tell me what that is. <laughs> He's not gonna tell you. The acting for this is perfect, by the way. It's like uh <sighs> What was the race off Mass Effect? That was all killed by the Reapers. Can you stop them? Sure, I can just Proto molecule is crazy. What's the lieutenant up to? He's cracking, that's for sure. But what's he doing? Is he going to kill himself? Why is this? Huh. I guess some people would do that. I don't know if there's a bit more to this. 
I was just showing the stress on the human mind at the situation they're in. Mm. Mm. Conflict on the APA ship already. <laughs> I'm pushing the buttons. So it's a magic trick. So is your whole damn reality. That's interesting. I had someone point out is he never saw him about the hat, so. Amoeba. Monkey? Mozart. <laughs> One way to describe it. I like how to describe that. That's pretty interesting. So yeah, it's like he's took pieces and just created something out of it, but then added a bit of his own as well. Messing with reality in a way. Mad. If they seem to contradict, it's because we haven't understood one of them yet. you feel bad about Lieutenant because she could have probably saw that coming with the Lieutenant committing suicide. Turns out. Service? Of course, who is it? Uh, See, there were signs there, which could have kept ignoring him, didn't she? So. Respects are saying not a suicide. It's a terrible euphemism, actually. Excuse me. Yeah. He just needed someone to be there for him. Well, no, he was ignored, weren't he? So. People just people at the end of the day. It's needed to sit with people when they're scared and grieving. Putting things back into perspective. Minister is supposed to. Hmm. Don't take the sacrifice of knowledge. Oh, Sorry. fuck it out. Two it's mad how much religion can be a common mechanism for a lot of people. My well, I guess it just explains the unknown. All of the burdens that Jordan carried. He isn't here. Or for making it worse. Are you going to reach out to him? You think I should? I think you should do. No, you, you shouldn't. You're going to get her killed. <laughs> you obviously don't know me very well. <laughs> Please stay with her if you're going to do that. Fuck me, she's a bit off hinged at the moment. You might want to slow down now. I'm so curious where the show is going to go from here. I've got. Oh my god, the mysteries find that fascinating. Mate, all the knowledge. It's because every bit of humanity carries a bit of data. It's like nothing gets rid of it. You got atmosphere too. The case. Or maybe just the next clue. <laughs> this is insane. I love this. How do they keep making the program out of so bloody interesting? We've got time. Music is amazing. Oh my god, I love it. Oh, it's so bloody epic. How did Bobby end up in this situation? <laughs> Surely she's done enough. It's not going there, is it? No, it's quite going there. Is Miller in there? Or is it just a heap of proto molecule pushing my button? You're running out of time. Not good this would be so tempting because that like, is it Mill is not Miller was on the <sighs> so could feel Julie. Could nothing to do with Julie. Fuck you then. For all I know, touching that thing could end up killing everyone I love. It's a good point. People she died to save. No risk. No reward. That is such a oh my god, like how can you trust she this? But she was already gone, wasn't she? She couldn't feel any more pain, but you could. Acting from holding, everyone's acting so on point this episode. What would you would you do? Ah, see, I'd just do it because you haven't really got a choice. But you could just fuck over everything by doing that. Ah, oh. 
You put it in everyone's head. He knows what he's doing. After I left, I bet you were all praised for me, yeah? How important it is to respect the captain and so on. That way, when Manipulative the 100. Over, they all know it was because you had to. No choice. Yeah. Drum is smart. I love her. Or else what? Drummer boss. That is pretty much what he's doing now. I love that. Ah, oh, I love how she just calls him out. Clarissa? Oh, you're dead. Why'd you come alone? It's Tilly. Tilly Fagan. I was friends with your sister, Julie. A little. You get me confused with someone else. Get away from her. She's crazy. Okay. Go test the humanity again. How much? How important is vengeance for you? How did you find me? Happened. You have no reason to be suffering for it. <laughs> ah! Fuck! Run! Get away from her. She's using the drug. Ah! She's dead. Ah! Why did she go alone? Ah! Oh, fuck's sake. Why is it towards the end of the episode? I think it always goes down in this show. <laughs> oh. Come with us and we'll figure it all out. I can't. I have to do this. There's no way to. Explain. It's like a you fucking like finale to Think a TV this. fucking video. Alex, it's like Mass Effect 2 coming to an end. Me. Wait, what? Oh, oh. Go, hold and go. What the hell? Don't kill Bobby, I'll be fuming. Bobby, get out of there. Oh shit. Alright, though, no, she's safe. Fuck's go at me. Why was only he? Because he's a fair. Is it just stopping everything that's a fair? Oh, his skin came off as well. Why did it only do him though? Is it to complete? It was completing it itself. What? It repaired itself. Oh, so it took him to repair the damage that were done. Because of the grenade explosion. So, wait. Are we time travelling? Oh, this is so well shot. Hey, it's the bird. That's part of Miller's memory. Did you like see the future or something? I feel like you could have seen the future there. Or the past? No, because he wouldn't have saw the past again. <laughs> I don't know what to say. This is crazy. What I love about this is not all making sense straight away. And it just leaves so much room to learn and just expand on it. It's like it's now setting up the next story arc, and as we know, with so far with the expanse, it's come, this is going to be this is eight books long, isn't it? So it's got to keep escalating the story for eight books. And I don't know if is the story finished in the books or it's still going. I think it's still going. They've got to keep things interesting, keep building up new threats. What I like about this is not yeah, it's keeping us in the dark. Maybe I should probably understand some more things than I sh and at the moment, but. It is fascinating. It looks like we're going to do a bit of time travel, baby, because it did just show the past. So it did hold and see the future. I'm getting some dark vibes from it. Um, if any of you have watched Dark, um, and I've and, I, and as the show keeps mentioning, it's messing with reality and stuff like um, from the conversation Holden Miller were having, how time, how it's like it's little the brains, all these little parts, and he's picking little bits of it, and then added a hat, which they've been seeing. So it's picking like original. And then we, you know, the, the, that was definitely Miller's memories when he was talking. So it's like, oh, the re reality is all messed up. And the show isn't based on magic. I know that's for sure. So it's definitely doing some twist, twist with reality. Then we have the stuff going on with, I would say the weaker storylines, maybe the priest girl and the one from Lost. But 
I like the idea that I had in human, like that guy needed help and she weren't there for him. And there's a lot of people probably like that on the ship at the moment. And then we've got Julie, Julie, Julie Miles daughter going, Barmy, uh, everything just stopped. And then that proto molecule used that guy to repair itself, it's damage. And it's just like, oh my God, the proto molecule is so OP. I just want to know what the proto molecule goal is. I'm so interested if later on they actually show the race that's sent off the proto molecule. Like if there's a show ever go that far. Um, we got another great conversation between Alex and Alex and Amos. I thought I was fantastic. I love listening to Amos talk. Well, like how like he's he doesn't fear anything anymore. And I'd say it freaks Alex out is a big deal because I remember in the books it was mentioned how pilots are trained to pretty much deal with every situation. But he's not driving, is he? So I guess it's a bit different because when they're in the pilot zone, like I guess that means they're not bothered. But because he wasn't technically in pilot zone, he couldn't let fear take over. Um, because it was to do with Eros because he wasn't freaking out about Eros at all I think it was in the books uh, whereas like Amos and Naomi were absolutely freaking out they went against everything they own is Holden's course like set out before him and it can't be changed that whole have we actually got a will or is everything planned out because everything's just a piece of data at the end of the day so yeah that's fascinating Holden Holden and Miller's acting was the acting in this show, I don't, I don't think I've praised it much, but I should. The acting is phenomenal. Like it's so good. Like this show has some really good actors. And then we have the little side story I'm going on with um, uh, the OPA. I think that's just going to fall to pieces. Drama basically called out uh, the general. He is playing like cowboy. He plays out. He calls right in front of everyone and plays like, oh, praise, praise the to to to, to, to hell. And then when like things do turn his way, he'd be like, oh, I guess I have to take it off. He was doing that, and that is pretty cool. How to brought that up. Oh, I love all the storylines. All the storylines were fun and all these different characters, and it's dead interesting. Bobby was all right, though. I'm glad Bobby survived. Um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to see how this mystery is going to unfold with the Proto Molecule. Proto Molecule is such a fascinating enemy. It's probably one of my favourite... It's one of my favourite... Cause it's not a bit the pro molecule is one of my favorite sort of plot devices i've ever seen in the show like he it's such a good plot device that keeps the story going keeps the story changing doesn't feel repetitive and it doesn't feel stale and i love that i think it's a really good plot device i think that's what you would call it because it's not really a character is it so i guess it is it's a hive mind sort of thing pro molecule fascinates me to no end i'm really curious to see where the story's gonna go and then it mentioned the previous civilization so the civilization that made the pro molecule are they dead now are they like um is it Prom Prom what is it Prometheans? I'm guessing they're um, I'm thinking they're Mass Effect race. What we got wiped out. Um, I'm guessing they're like they that race is gone now. They were destroyed. Maybe their own technology destroyed them. I'm curious to find out a bit more about that. There's so much data on that little star thing. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the reaction. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and I hope to see.